All right. Well, welcome everyone this evening. We're so glad to have you um, for our team huddle. And just as a note, we are not going to do our team huddle every week. And we we are we decided, Eleanor and I decided that we will not do the team huddle on the Wednesday that follows the Nation Monday meeting because that's too much meeting meeting. And um, so be on the, the first Monday of the month nation meeting. We won't have a Wednesday huddle that Wednesday. It'll be the following. Then we'll skip a Wednesday, and then it'll be the following. So just twice a month we'll do the team huddle because we certainly don't want to, you know, uh, take up anybody's IPA time and, um, you know, for getting out there and actually getting in front of people. But Eleanor and I do feel that our team huddles are very important because there is always so much going on um, in our businesses and in Arbonne in general that we want to make sure that everybody is up to date and that everybody has an opportunity to share any wins that they're having, um, also to um, ask any questions or just we're here to support each other, you know, to really give each other the inspiration and motivation to, um, you know, building our businesses um, to the very top of this company. And I know each one of you are on here tonight because that is what your goal is. And it shows by you um, being connected here and joining in on our team huddles. So I'm going to start first, and what I'm going to say is you've pretty much heard this already, but I'm repeating it because it is of that it is of that much importance um, to our businesses right now. And I just want to talk just briefly about the 30 and 30 again, and I'm specifically going to talk about the close because that, from what I'm hearing from um, team rev is that that is the hardest part is the close and you know the close with a um with the one-on-one -on -one when you're presenting the is our bond for you is is similar to a close at a at an event you're having so if you're doing a workshop or a presentation two to three people around the kitchen table you know whatever you want to call it you know if if you don't feel like you close well you know, if your track record shows you don't close well at a party, then you're probably also not closing very well with your one-on-one -on -one is Arbon for you. And the only way that you're going to get better at your close is if you do more of them. It's the same thing with having a party an event or a workshop. The more you do them, the better you're going to get at the close, the better you're going to get at guiding your prospect to the um, to the sale, and you know we hate to say that we sell Arbon, but in reality, we do sell products because our you know we're paid and we're promoted on the QV that that, that goes along with the product. So we have to get good at the close, you know. And people want to be people really want to do, and so we just have to be very confident in ourselves when we go to close. And so I just want to focus a little bit back again on the close with the, um, the 30 and 30, the one-on-one, -on -one. after we, after you have presented the is our bond for you, you know, you're going to say, um, just so I know um, how to follow up on a scale of one to three, one being your interest in the products and three being, you know, tell me, um, how I can start my own business that you you want to join my team. Where do you see yourself from one to three? And if they say one Then you know, you're gonna say something like Well, that's wonderful. Why don't we gather a few of your friends together because I can give you the best discount on product for you when we have two or three of your friends together and I will, you know, show you more about the products and, and um, you know, I'll, I'll, I'm trying to think what I'm going to say. I will show, I'll show you more about the products. You'll learn more about the products. But in the meantime, let's get you signed up as a preferred client so you can experience them. And when we have two or three of your friends together, you can share your experience with them. And, you know, of course, if they say no, then, you know, you want to, if they say no to the hosting, then you, of course, you want to really 
you know, show them the products and because they said they're one, they're interested in the product. Let's go ahead and get your product order and relate it back to an Arbonne special. You know, Arbonne, you know, has, you know, the free PC sign up going on right now. So let's go ahead and get your order in so you can take advantage of that um, free preferred clients sign up. And then if they say, if, you know, if they say there are two, and this is where I've been getting most of my people because they want to give themselves a little bit of room. You know, they really like what, what we said about, you know, Arbon the business opportunity, but they're not quite ready to um, jump in. And so here again, you're going to say, awesome. You know, is there any additional um, information I can give you that would get you to a three? And then you want to answer all the questions, you know, that they have. And if they, you know, say, well, you know, I need to think about it because this has been the typical response I get, then you say, I totally get it. You know, I understand. So why don't we do this? I'll send you home with some information and you're going to send them home with a curiosity folder or a prospecting folder. And in the meantime, why don't we get two or three of your friends together? And that way I can come show you, share with you and your friends the products and you'll learn more about the products, learn more about the business opportunity. And if you decide to join the business with me, this um, workshop will go towards building your business. And if you decide not to join the business with me, that's no big deal. You've really helped me out and you're going to get some great product um, for getting a couple of your friends together. So anyway, and if they say, you know, if they say no to the hosting again, then you're going to again say, well, let's go ahead and get you signed up as a preferred client, get you some products to experience. That way you'll know, you'll be able, you will know what Arbonne products are like. Let's get you signed up today. You know, that's the whole thing. Show them a sense of urgency. Tell them, let's, let's get you signed up today. Because you and I know, because when I have left, and I've left several of my one-on-ones without signing them up today, and do you know how hard it is to get back in touch with them? You know, everybody's crazy life. You know, they want to, they, oh yeah, I want to, I want to, they're texting me back, I want to, I want to, but with their schedule and my schedule, it's been really hard to con reconnect. So I'm going into the one-on-ones now with that sense of urgency. They have to sign up today. I'm going to do everything I can, but they're not going to walk out from that one-on-one -on -one without at least being a preferred client. And, you know, and having a, you know, and then, you know, the second thing is also getting a workshop or presentation, you know, to three friends together on my calendar. So, but there are the times that they do, that they do leave. And then the three, you know, if they say there are a three, you, got, you all know what to do with a three. You sign them up right then and there. And again, you know, you try, you want to make it worth your time because we're spending valuable time going to these one-on-one -on -one appointments. You want to make it worth your time for being there. So it's either a preferred client, a, a party booked, or a consultant signed up. I mean, the, those are the things that you need to have when you walk out when you walk out the door from that one on one. It needs to be worth your time. So you know, if there are three, you sign them up, get them signed up right then and there, and then you know you say let's let's talk in a day or two, and let's let's get your launches on the schedule, and then once you get their launches on the schedule, then you have them send out the 30 and 30 texts, but only to 20 people, not to 100. You know, we don't want to overwhelm somebody who's brand brand new um, to the business. And that, if they do their two launches and they send out the, the 20 texts, they're going to get 40 people. They're going to see 40 people, be in front of 40 people that month. And that's going to get them into district manager call during their first month. But if you are unable to close, and, um, and, and it has happened to me also, what you want to do is you, your goal is then to get them as quickly as possible to the next exposure. So what's, what's an exposure? An exposure is going to be a video, Discover Arbonne, a SoundCloud, Discover Arbonne. And you want to pick something that relates to them, you know, to their life experiences, to, you know, what they do to their family life or to something, something that they'll be able to relate to or um, invite them to Our Nation Take a Peek, where we do the Facebook Lives, because they can scroll back and see all of the live Facebook um, DA recordings on there. And plus, you know, invite them to the, the live one that's coming up. We have one every Monday. 
or you can invite them to a three-way call with your upline or a three-way Zoom with your upline or invite them to a live Discover Arbonne or to a car party. And, um, you know, and, and you want to do this and then also follow up because you send them home with samples or you, you sign them up as a, for a client. You want to follow up with a phone call. <laughs> and you know, see how they're enjoying the products and see if they have any more questions and if they're ready to sign up as a consultant. And so here's some verbiage that was on our, on Cecilia's VP page that was that for just this, if you weren't able to close them at the one-on-one. -on -one. And so you would text the following, you would say, hey Mary, thanks for your time today. I love learning more about, how you, about you and how much we have in common. I'm so excited to um, see you again and hear how you love the samples. By the way, here's a great video of a gal that reminds me of you. So that's moving them to the next exposure. And so you've already said you're gonna follow up with them. And so your follow-up, and it needs to be a phone call, your follow-up, and so in that follow-up phone call, you're gonna say, okay, you know, you know how, how are you loving the products, and then, okay, you know, what are you waiting, what are we waiting for? Let's do this. Don't be scared. I'll lead you. And if you've been listening to Linda Parker's Let's Go Area calls, I love what she says. And really, Krista brought this to my attention. I love what she says when she says, let's make it a Snickers decision, not a mortgage decision when it comes to be joining up as a consultant. Because so many times they leave the one-on-one -on -one thinking, wow, do I really want to do this? It, like it's a huge life-changing decision. We know that it can be life-changing, but initially it doesn't have to be that big of a decision because when they jump in, especially for the free sign-up of $79, they're getting great product. They're not losing out on anything. So, you know, you want to tell them, let's make it a Snickers decision and not a mortgage decision. You know, if you decide you're not going to do this business, you're going to have great product. You're going to have a 35%, a 35 to 50% discount for the rest of the year. So, you know, let's go ahead and do this. And so that's, um, what I wanted to cover with the, um, with the close to the one-on-one -on -one. and Eleanor, I'm going to throw it over to you because I'm going to slip out and go pick up cross and I'll be on my phone. All right. You just be careful, sweetheart. Okay. All right. <laughs> yes, mom. <laughs> I'll go and get, get my little, uh, cough drop out of my mouth here. Okay. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Kim. I love the, uh, I love that verbiage that uh, Cecilia always says to uh, give them little spurts of exposure. And so that's whenever they go, no, 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 you can't seem to close them. Then that last one that she said, you know, you send them a DA and go, oh, sweetheart, I'm going to send you a DA because this gal just so much reminds me of you. And I'll get back with you and we'll, you know, see how you do with the samples. But make sure that you give them, you know, that exposure, that second, and maybe even a third if you have to. But it's those little short bursts of exposures that I think it takes like four or five for someone to finally uh, really come on board. So don't worry if they say no right away. Just keep doing what you're doing. Okay, I'm just going to share the, the uh, really the here and the now. And, uh, and this will not take very long. But first of all, noon Pacific, October the 17th, which is a Tuesday, you have to be a DM. It's not an option. Remember, GTC registration opens. and it will fill up so fast, but you do have to be a district manager and above to register on the 17th. I don't know when they will open it up. So we want all of you in district wall, all of you consultants to get to that DM level as quickly as possible. And this month is a great month to go into area qual or even finish district. I'm dead serious. Uh, another date I want you to put on your calendar is September the 21st, 2018, the 21st and the 22nd, 
2018. That is Cecilia Stoll's VP retreat. Seriously, that's a long-term goal. I want you guys there. All right, <clears throat> you can have an amazing October if you take advantage of everything that Armand is offering. Uh, you already know that the sign-up fees uh, have been waived for PCs. They still get their free gift. This is a reason to call people. Um, I, you know, we are doing the 30 and 30 for sure, but these are great fillers. This is a way to call people and say, oh my gosh, you know, you've been ordering. I know that uh, you've looked at Arbonne. Now is the time. It does not cost you a thing to join Arbonne. And if you have a 150 qualifying order, which is not what it's going to cost you, uh, you're going to get a free gift and some really fabulous uh, choices of a free gift. And then, oh gosh, forgive me. I'm still like, ugh. Uh, also, consultants can, uh, now this is going to be a little bit more difficult, I think, because they have to have a $500 order to waive that $79 sign up. But I know last night I was signing up a new consultant and she had gotten to like 416 and uh, she just went ahead and ordered something else in order to get that free uh, product up to $100. Okay, and then sometimes if it's someone close by, if you have a loose order, I don't see anything wrong with putting order with theirs to get it to that $500 level, really. All right. But remember, you can still sign up uh, consultants with the, the $79 and get the free gift and all of that as well. So, but this is just so neat. When I was putting her order in with her, it was like, it showed $79. And when we hit 500, $79 disappeared. She got her free product. She had her free serum. And it was like, oh my gosh, she was so tickled. And I was tickled. So also, it, uh, this applies to people that want to upgrade uh, from a PC to a consultant. All right. So I will try to lower my voice. The teacher in me gets very excited. Um, so that's, those are two right now things that you can do. And I am loving that we are getting that free serum. And there's, uh, that's another reason I have texted more of my just client consultants to let them know about this free serum. And if they have a $300 order, and a lot of times your client consultants orders are 300 or more, then they get two free serums. If they have a 450, they get three. All right. So it's in increments of 150. And I know Marianne Lane called me today because she was afraid she had, she had ordered under her name for someone and she goes, Oh no, they got my free, they got my free serum. No, every single time you get a free serum. So that is huge. And I love that Arbonne is so green that they just won't toss the empty bottles. So this is new serum in the old bottle, free, free, free. So just talk to everybody that you know. All right, have you benched your best player? Have you benched your best player? You know, I notice with myself, sometimes I get so busy with my team, you know, or so busy just being busy that I bench myself. So I want you to be really uh, alert, be really focused on not benching your best player. You, you have always got to be the best player on your team. And something else that you've got to remember, because I don't care who you are, I don't care if you're in the best, uh, you know, your business is just booming, at some point you're gonna hit a wall or you're gonna plateau. It happens to everyone, okay? I just want you to remember that there is no perfect time to start your momentum again you can literally start your momentum at any time all right you don't have to wait so if you're in that you know if you're in that uh if you're zooming zooming if you're booming awesome but if you're stuck or you've hit a wall keep your head in the game and okay play offensive 
get that momentum rolling again. You can do it. We do it all the time. So that is so important to remember. You are never going to be stuck forever. It always changes. All right. So just remember that. And um, let's see. Um, oh, this is something that I just think is so important. So many times we have been saying, oh, we've only got 17 summers with our kids. Oh, we have only seven summers. Oh, my goodness. Well, then that causes us from working our business to our utmost potential because we're so afraid of not making, you know, of, of leaving our kids too long or, or not giving our kids enough time or whatever. Well, Cecilia is deaf on this. She just, and because she has adult children now, and Brenda Fouts and I, we know about adult children. Trust me, you still want to play with your adult children. You still want to spend time with your adult children. And so you want to build this business now so that you can have a great time, not only with your children that are home, but that you're having a great time with your children as they grow up and become adults. You still want to go to Colorado with them. You know, you want to go to the beach with them. You may want to go to Puerto Rico before it got devastated. Um, you know, you still want to do things with your kids. So don't let that be an excuse. Let that motivate you. Build your business now for your little kids and your big kids. Uh, it will mean just as much to you then. And also, you'll have a lot more memories and a lot of rewards. Um, I want to challenge you now. Three different things. Okay. I want to challenge you first. All of you DMs have been DMs for a while now. All right. It's time to get out of DMville. It's time to leave town and move on to area. All right. So uh, this month, with everything that we have going on, you can earn your DM bonus and get halfway to area. And those of you that got halfway to area last month, you know what you're supposed to be doing. And I don't have to tell you, do I, Charlotte? <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to throw that in there. Okay. Uh, take advantage of everything that Arbon is offering. And use the, use the holiday line just to sell products. All right? Your flagship lines are the most important, especially in the 30 and 30. But use the holiday to just sell products and have fun. Uh, set some big, audacious goals. Because I want you in the next 90 days, you know, by the end of October, I mean, uh, by the end of December, to be at another title, another level. You have to make that audacious a goal or it's not going to happen because this is our best quarter. You don't want to wait January to make your move. Okay. So for the next 30 days, I'm going to ask you to do three things. And Cecilia asked this of us. And now she asks us all the time, become a member of the five o'clock club. Now she actually gave us some leeway. She said, you can also become a member of the 530 Club. But the reason she is so big on this is that she took her son, Connor, to Hawaii. And they got to stay in this beautiful resort on the beach. And uh, one of the other guests in this little villa that they were staying in was this 30-something multimillionaire. And Connor asked him, he said, what is your secret? for success. And the guy said, I belong to the five o'clock club. I get up every morning at five o'clock. He says, that's my secret. And that's the secret that I share with everyone. Because if you get up at five or 5.30, then you have time to exercise. You have time to read. You have time to make, those, make that list that you did make the night before, of who you're gonna call, who you're gonna text for the 30 and 30 you know, whatever you need to do so that by eight o'clock you are like ready to, to start your day. And again, be on the offensive because don't be, don't let that enemy called average make, uh, make you uh, make a mess in your head or something. All right. Be on the offensive. I'm going to start asking on my team pay. Okay. Who's a member of the five thirty club. 
because you know me, five o'clock is just a little too early. But I'll say five o'clock, but you'll know I mean 5.30. <laughs> Who's a member of the five o'clock club? Cecilia is asking that of all of her nation. And so who's going to say, no, not me? No. So let's just see what a difference it makes by December. Also, uh, feed your mind with truth. Speak truth to yourself. We're always telling you to speak to truth to your team. No, speak truth to yourself. Do not uh, let negative head trash keep you from doing what you want to do. So you're going to walk across stage, aren't you, Tri uh, Krista, in April? Okay, I'm going to walk across stage. Yes, you are. I believe you. That is speaking truth to yourself. Okay? I'm going to go to GTC as area manager this year with a team. Or I'm going to GTC as an area man manager halfway to region with a team. Okay? Speak truth to yourself. You've got to. You've got to do it. And then uh, write three things. And this is going to hurt because it's hurt us. Write three things you're willing to give up. Three things that are in your way, that are in the way of your business. Television being one of them. You know, watching too much of it. Or even leaving TV on as background noise. Cecilia says that that literally kills creativity. You just don't realize it. So turn that TV off as background noise. We don't need it. We don't need it. And uh, volunteering. You may need to give up some of your volunteering. Just keep the most important, but not volunteer. Learn to say no, because as good as it is, the good is the enemy of the best. And you can, I know that one time my husband, uh, I was so involved in my church. My husband asked me, he said, Eleanor, why is it that every time the doors open in church, you have to be in the front? And it made me realize, oh my gosh, I have made church my little Christian habit. All right, so be really careful with that because there's a place, of course, but you're going to be able to do a lot more. You're not giving this stuff up forever, for just for a season while you get to area and get to region or get to district. And uh, anything that's going to prevent you from giving 100% to your business right now until the end of December, you guys, I'm just talking about the next 90 days. So. Be a part of the 5 a.m. club. Speak truth, truth, uh, read truth also. Read and speak truth to yourself and encourage yourself to give up three things that are stopping you, that are in your way. All right? Sometimes we just need to have time to think. And with that TV blaring in the background, we don't. Sometimes when you get up that early in the morning, you're going to have time just to maybe sit back before the kids get up and kind of just think. Some of your best thoughts may come into your head. And uh, moms, you can, uh, I think this is especially good for you because once those kids get up, there is no time. And I, I know that. And um, let me see if there's anything else because I think that's about it. Um, oh, the way you do anything is the way you do everything. So by doing the three things, by, you know, doing the three things I'm challenging you to do by the end of December, that is giving everything you've got. So that means everything that you do in your life, you need to give it everything you've got because it, it bleeds into everything that you do. Your business and your life become seamless. So the way you do anything is going to be the way you do everything. So anyway, Lots of advantages this month, and um, I sound like a frog. I've been a frog all week. I called my doctor and told him to give me medicine, and that I wasn't coming to see him because there were too many sick people there, and he wouldn't. <laughs> he told me to go send my husband to get me some Sudafed or something, so that's what I did. So anyway, I love you guys, and Kim, I don't know if you're on or not on. But I think we're going to just uh, close it for now. Do you guys have any questions? Anything you want to share? Yes, Brenda. Um, 
I just want to make, do you have to be in a district manager qual or second step qual to go to register for GTC? Rachel and I were talking about that. I just want to make sure. I, that think, I think on the 17th, you have to be a district manager. The a 17th district, of? When they first open registration. Okay. At least that's what Cecilia told us. She okay. said, let me go over that again real quick, just to make right. sure. Okay. Thank you. Noon Pacific, October 17th. Now, this is straight from Cecilia. Okay. You have to be a DM, not an option. And GTC is not an option either. So, to me, that is just another reason to help these consultants get to DM. Right. But here, my question is if they're in qualification, then can they, they register? No, they have to be a district Period. to register. Uh huh. Okay. And then I'm sure they're going to open it up. Okay. Okay, I see. All right. Okay. Okay. Any other questions, you guys? All right. Let's make this happen. Uh, I am, this is a great month. I feel it coming on, and I know you guys do too. So keep doing those 30 and 30. And just remember that uh, it's we work in a 90-day lifestyle here. That's why the next 90 days are so important. So don't get discouraged. There was someone on Cecilia's Nation that made 80 texts and did not get one yes. So she goes, I'm a little discouraged. You know, so, and, you know, she'll turn around next month and have 25 appointments. So just keep doing what we're doing. Okay? And go ahead, Trash. I love you. Bye. I don't know how to turn this thing off. I think we all just leave the meeting. You're so funny. We can unmute and talk. Yeah. Okay. Sherry? Yes, you can unmute. Hey, guys, can you hear me? Yes. 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 Okay. I don't know what happened to my video on my car, but... You can unmute recording. yourself, Jennifer. Okay. Hi. Hey. <laughs> this is Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> on my Hi, team. Jennifer, welcome. She finally got on. <laughs> I don't know. I think we lost her. Is Kim still recording? I don't uh, know. Can I... You, can, yes. Can it says it's recording. Okay. Yes, we can hear you. Oh, okay, okay that's what I was saying. Yeah, it, I can't turn the recording off until I get home. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so just chat among yourselves until I get home to turn the recording okay. off. Okay. Thanks, Tara, Eleanor. I appreciate you. Is there any way for us to turn it off? No. Okay. Mm -hmm. We would just have to leave. <laughs> well, let's, we will just chat among ourselves. <laughs> if you leave, it'll, it'll, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get off of here. I definitely need to get better at the clothes. I'm stinking at the clothes. So that's, that's, a, oh, that's just something I'm just going to have to keep working with. I'm getting some great one-on-ones, but, you know, you know, they're like a two, two and a half. And, you know, but I'm still sitting with, okay, I'll check back with you. Send in you all these samples and, it's just work, but it, it it's gonna come, and um, I'm getting better at yeah. at the one on ones, you know, for sure, because I'm getting the I'm getting the experience. So um, anyway, that's that's kind of where I'm struggling is is the clothes, but I'm following up really good, and um, but we'll see come October thirty first at my numbers. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, um, the, the little bursts. Send them a DA. Yeah. Hey, this, yeah. reminded me, this reminded me of you, sweetheart. You know, can't wait to talk to you about the sample. And, yes. Uh, you know, it'll it'll get you back together. And if you can't get back together, Zoom, FaceTime, whatever. You may not have a live meeting. You can still, once you've met, you can Zoom. I've been Zooming a lot of people because, you know, you have, so you've got to find the time to meet with them. And yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. yeah, the phone conversations are really hard, but I think if you're first face to face, because right now I'm I'm working on my long distance people, um, and so when you're on the phone, it's a little bit different. It's more personal when you get to see each, you know get to see each other face to face. Yeah. So um, that's what I'm going to be doing this week. Yeah, but, Zoom. Um, I I love to Zoom so I can we can talk. 
Right, right. Even if they're, you know, 100 miles away, it's yeah. still, yeah, yeah. that meeting. All um, right. Well, I do a lot of Zooms also. Are you having success with the Zooms, Tara? Yes. Yes. Yeah. I like it. Um, because, you know, like if they're hundreds of miles away or in a different state, you know, most people, or at least the ones that I'm talking to are, um, I'll say, well, if we can't meet in person, we can always meet on web conference. And they're like, oh, yeah, that's so cool. And, you know, yep. it's easy. They love it. Yeah. <laughs> and you know what I've noticed? I don't know if you guys that are Zooming, if you've noticed this, they don't hold you to the 20 minutes. Right. No. You no, know, it gives you a little bit of time to really dig in with them and, and get to know them a little bit better and, uh, you know, share your life a little bit more than you do just in that 20 minute. I don't think yeah. I've had a one-on-one -on -one that was less than an hour. Yeah. <laughs> Me Especially neither. I assume they're not really in that much of a hurry. Yeah. <laughs> Well, mostly for me, you know, I'm meeting moms and it's just like, oh my gosh, I get to talk to an adult. Yeah. <laughs> um, I do want, I'm, I'm fixing to get off here, but I do want to say that Kim and Eleanor, you guys have been doing a fantastic job with these um, trainings, really. I've, I've been getting a lot of good stuff and, and it's been, it's been extremely helpful. So I think that whatever Cecilia did to you guys, it worked <laughs> because you are oozing onto us. And so it's got me fired up. And I know that several of y'all, we've been talking, it's got you fired up too. And it's okay if we get stumped a little bit. We just got to keep going. Keep going. So I'm going to get I off get of to here. be a peek at some of her nation, like her recognition. And I'm yeah. telling you, these people are no different than us, but she'll have 10 new districts in like on their nation. They'll have like 10, they'll have five new area managers, two people in uh, halfway to region, somebody going into region. I mean, the recognition is amazing and it's the belief that they can do it. So we have to have that same belief that, and they you know, poured into us by each other that yes, by golly, we can do this. By the end of December, we are all going to be a level different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I think the consistency, I think, you know, that's what was happening early on in my business. You know, you get five, ten no's, and you're just, you're deflated, and you just like, well, I'm going to try again next month, and, and you just can't keep, you just got to keep going every day a little bit, every day a little bit, every day a little bit, and then you're like, yes! She said yes, <laughs> and, and and then you're back on, you know, you're you're back in the game. So just staying consistent. I've been trying so hard, just praying. God's been giving me the strength to get through that. But anyway, I gotta go. Grandma's over here. Have fun with your grandma. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to y'all later. Good night. I didn't get to say hi to Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Hi. Hi, Jennifer. Hi. Don't you think that texting has been good, Do though? Do what? Oh, sorry. Go ahead, Jennifer. No, I just said it took me a, a while to get on here. Figure it out. Yeah, her, her, her tech support wasn't that good. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Brenda, tech support? My 11-year-old was in the shower, so. <laughs> right. I told her to ask Tessa. <laughs> Yeah, she was in the shower. Oh well, she got it. So we have uh, we have two launch parties scheduled for Jennifer this month. So yes. fantastic, fantastic. Ooh. We're excited. <laughs> well, all right. Well, I can turn the recording off now because I'm back at home. But thanks for putting up with my <laughs> having to go. You, everyone's moms. You all know how it is. That was quick. <laughs> Yeah, well, it's not it's not too far down the road, but it is it is a you know it's down the road. Can't walk. It's it's dark in Little Rock. Can't walk. No. <laughs> I wouldn't walk outside where you are. No. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not. All right, guys. Thanks so much for being on this evening, and we have so much time left in the month. So much time. So just go out there, do what you know how to do, and just, you know, share our bond because that's, that's what we, 
that's what we have and it's an amazing an amazing opportunity and products to share with everyone so anyway good night everyone love you good all night. good luck with your launch thank you thanks Eleanor.